model. Independent thinkers. Why can't you make up? Mindful and self-aware learners. Practice and how will we practice? Mapping out their own goals. These are the talented, creative and committed students of Kunskap Skolan School. They give us opportunities. I love opportunities. So I think it's just a perfect mix of what a child wants. You are free to do whatever you want to do. You're free to like look at things differently. You're free to have your goals. Over here, you get to learn at your own pace. Recently, I became the head of the editorial board of Kunskap Skolan. So that has given me a push and it has given me a boost. A relatively young academic institution, Kunskap Skolan, which literally translates to the knowledge school in Swedish, opened its first school in India in the year 2013, following an established overseas presence. With its first impactful footsteps in Gurgaon, Kunskap Skolan School announced its intention to be a school with a difference. When we talk about Kunskap Skolan, we use the word bilning, which is a Swedish word which means learning for life. And I think it's very important that anything that you provide in the school, you're preparing our children for living their lives outside school. A child to feel that a school is a place where I control my learning, I, I choose my learning. For the child to feel that, okay, here is a place that someone actually cares about what I want to learn. This shape looks very interesting. So can you just brief me about this shape? This shape is actually known as a squared pyramid. At its heart, it has the KED philosophy of education, which offers a distinct 360-degree perspective of the kind of learners the school wants its students to be. In KED program, we have a very structured idea about our methodology and how we work with the students and train them to become great learners. typical day at Kunskap Skolan is very different and tailor-made for making students think rather than just passively take in information. The children begin their day with a base group interaction which helps them plan and strategize for the day, discuss the world around them and their awareness of the issues within and outside the class. The students then move on to workshops in different subjects which is planned to work on achieving their learning goals individually, in pairs or in groups under the guidance of the faculty. When we are teaching students to plan, to execute, to re revisit, um, to see how the, the goals, goal setting is working and what is the reason, what kind of support, what strategies they're using. And this is really a way of life. Can you just go through them and tell me if you were able to achieve them or not? Said that it's successful. That's nice. A distinct feature of the KED methodology of education is the stress on personalized coaching offered to each student. This is perhaps one of the hallmarks of the KED teaching program where each student spends 15 minutes with his base group teacher every week, being mentored yet given the independence to decide their goals and strategies of learning. In our KED way, we are looking at personalized attention through personalized you know, education with the students. You have the weekly coaching session with students. On a weekly basis, the students are looking at setting their weekly goals uh, and strategies, which they are reviewing and going through once again on a weekly basis with the teachers. Life skill is an integral part of KED because uh, you are making them future ready. You are imparting skills of self-learning and being independent to the kids. Curricular and co-curricular activities offer a rich blend for students to understand the breadth and connectivity of subjects like science, social science, art, dance and music. We have four or five subjects which come under one theme and the idea is to make them connected because in real life also they are very connected. So when they start from a very early age like a, from grade one, they understand that these five subjects and that one thing is very uh, interconnected and how it affects our life. 
With its bold new approach to education in India, the school did take a leap of faith, but a leap which has been welcomed wholeheartedly by parents who sent their children here. Very important to us that the school focused on some core values because I don't think you want, you know, you want to have your kid to definitely know and learn, but most definitely also to know what it is to be ultimately good human beings in society and productive, you know, people in society. That was very critical to us and I think the school has done a very good job of sort of instilling some of those values in the kids. Very logical way of um, getting kids on board rather than the traditional way where you know if, if, your, ch if your child is coloring out of the line or doesn't remember a poem uh, that can't be a standard of evaluating whether a kid can or cannot be admitted. A school that puts the student at the heart of all its endeavors and a school which instills in students, faculty and the parents alike a happy, unique vibe. A yen to learn, push boundaries and achieve more than they thought was possible. This is what Kunskaps Kolan is at the forefront of building in its different branches across India.